chatted to this lovely lady on the phone a couple of days ago and I had such a fantastic feeling about her. I felt as though we'd known each other for yes. limit ages. Absolutely. And this is Andy, um, one of the founders of Wet Nose and this amazing, amazing day. Thank How you. are you feeling? Absolutely thrilled and delighted. Oh. We've had a terrific response from all the celebrities and the rescue centres. Um, so many people are saying thank you and it's about time and when's the next one? <laughs> oh, oh, no. Give her a break. Yeah. She, needs, she needs half an hour to recover. <laughs> Um, it's got to be televised, I think, next year, and yeah. there's definitely got to be a children in need type pro program, but for animals. Uh, it's long overdue, and it's about that time something was done for the animals everywhere, in the UK and globally. So that's that's the aim, and everybody around the country can get involved, and we can have a day of fun. I think that's fantastic and well deserved. I mean, why do you think today has been so successful? I mean, people, you've got celebrities, you've got film people, you've got amazing stories. What what makes it, what brought it all together? Because some people, they, many people can't achieve what you've achieved today. Thank you. Um, I just think it's so, it's so long overdue. I mean, we know what rescue centres do. Um, people know about children in need and fundraising and different things like that. But to put the two together, it's a new concept. And people are thinking, wow, I like this idea. You know, we can give awards to so many people. And I'm always left behind. And I think now's the time. The time is absolutely right to stand up now and say, right, we are going to help the animals, conservation, rescue work. We're going to stand up now and be counted and say, let's help the animals. And anything particularly stands out for you today, Andy? Any other stories? I mean, I'm so choked. Oh, I think Blue oh. is so many emotions. Oh, we locked in a shed for eight years. Yeah. Um, this is the, the dog, and this is, this is the winner of the... Uh, the UK's rescue centre, uh, best rescue yeah. pet competition. Um, he was locked in his shed for eight years. He had splinters in his jaws. Even Peter Regan, who read the story, yeah. was in some tears. And it just highlights so many problems. Um, animals are always the first to be picked on. But um, you know, hopefully, with all of us holding hands together, we can correct that and put it right. Well, it's a fantastic note to end on, so thank you. An inspiration. I'm really, really pleased to be here, so thank you. My, my new best friend, Andy.